Once you've completed your knowledge check, you'll be brought to a screen that shows you a rough overview of the things that you've uh, succeeded in mastering during your knowledge check. This pie, as it's referred to by Alex, will be used throughout your course to display which topics you have and have not mastered, and will update throughout the course to show uh, your progress in the course. Once you click continue, it'll bring you to the Alex sort of home screen and give you some quick overview on the things you can use. With the pie here, you can select a slice and it'll tell you how many topics you've mastered and how many topics there are remaining for you to master in that particular part of the Alex software. You can click on your timeline to show you uh, a personal timeline that Alex makes for you uh, for mastering your topics. And then click through next and it'll show you that when your next homework is due. In this case, it says the prerequisite review is due Friday at 6 a.m. And it tells you how many topics you've mastered and how many total topics there are. Once you're done looking at everything, you can start your path. When you start your path, Anytime it brings you to a new topic, whenever you're using Alex, it'll bring you to this page. This page is, as it says, your learning page. This page will help you to review all of the information for that topic before you actually do the questions on that topic. When you feel you're ready, you can click the Start button to begin answering questions on the topic. If you feel that you need additional help on the topic after viewing this, you can click on the Instructor Resources button and you'll have a link here which will bring you to a YouTube video designed specifically for that topic. I'll show you here if you click start it'll tell you in the top here how many correct questions in a row you need to master a topic and it'll tell you down here that if you need to go back to the explanation page you can simply click on the explanation button. By clicking this arrow you can see all of the topics that are due in this portion of Alex at the moment. If you click on the filter button and click on goal topics, then Alex will only show you the topics that are due at your next assignment. So in this case, it'll only show us those topics that are due Friday at 6 a.m. in the screen that I originally showed you. If you want to switch to any different topic, you can simply click on it and you'll be brought to that topic instead. Some of the topics are locked, as indicated by this locked screen here. If a topic is locked, that means you need to complete a prerequisite topic in order to do it. Alex does this so that it ensures you have a thorough understanding of any material necessary to be able to successfully complete that topic. If you click on locked, it'll show you exactly which topic you need to complete in order to unlock that. By completing this topic, you will have a better understanding of the material that will be covered in that uh, locked topic. The UAlbany Chemistry Department has chosen Alex as the program to help you learn general chemistry. The entire design of the Alex program is to help you master each individual concept in general chemistry. Towards that end, we have included things such as these instructional videos that are included with every topic that will help you learn things. If you ever need additional help, you can always seek out uh, your instructor for that help during the course. Please remember that you will need to do all of your topics in order to unlock the locked topics. It's really important to do those topics on time as you progress through the course when it's relevant to your test. Not only will doing it then help you with your exams, but you also don't get to avoid those problems in the future. As you fail to complete more topics, the locked topics will not unlock. You still need to complete the prerequisite topics. So it's in your best interest to do those topics while the uh, content is being covered in the course. So please remember all of this help that's available to you and that the UAlbany Chemistry Department is here to help you learn chemistry. We hope you have a good semester.